What is up guys, B Pitch here bringing you episode 15 of my Minecraft series playing on the Xbox 360. Today what I want to go over is I want to go over some ideas and thoughts for future DLC that Mojang or 4J Studios may come out with. I hope, because um, I heard some rumors that they're going to try to take this game in a different direction as to differentiate the two uh, games, the PC versus the Xbox. So, if that's the case, I would like to give a couple ideas. Maybe someone out there might actually watch this. Guys, uh, subscribers, please feel free to share this. I'll link some of that information uh, below in the description on how you can do that. Because I am the number one source for Minecraft Xbox 360 information. Alright guys, let's get started. So I was sitting back and I was actually thinking, I'm like... What can make this game different? What's not in the PC game? Because the PC game is almost, it almost has everything you could somewhat think of. I mean, without getting too crazy, uh, keeping everything on a, uh, I guess, a square block uh, level. You know, obviously, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, no, give me something, give me something that's circular and so forth. And, you know, different shapes, blah blah blah. I'm not going to go that route today, guys. Uh, the first thing I came across was rubber. I was thinking, like, man, you know, it would be cool if there was um. Uh, some roads like you could actually make I guess tar or something like that like I, not, not necessarily give me a car but give us give us you know the design that way we could have like create streets create roads um, for the for the Xbox and I was thinking I'm like well what resources will we need so it was actually a win-win situation so gravel which is one of the most useless things on the game outside of getting flints I find uh, because I, I don't even use it for decorating anything other than unless you're gonna set up a trap or something like that uh, but we don't even have pistons. So, um, I was thinking like, you know, let's see. If they could, it could integrate rubber trees, uh, and I'm, I'm not sure how they want to actually allow us to mine them, because in real life, you know, rubber trees, is, is, they don't just cut it down like a tree uh, to get lumber. They actually tap it with like, almost like a sap tree, if you guys are familiar how to get syrup. So, <clears throat> I was thinking, I'm like, you know, there's two ways. You, they, they could kind of let, let us get around that, by chopping it down like like we would normally a tree so we get lumber it would just be like a, a rubber resource and then we can mix that rubber into gravel because that's what the majority of streets are made from today is recycled rubber gravel tar and a couple other you know obviously polymers and so forth but i was thinking you know something as simple as like allowing us to mix gravel which is useless so we, we one we get a gain of use of gravel two uh, i don't know if they want to give us tar or not or turpentine or something like that um, but I was just thinking gravel and rubber, and that would immediately give us a block of like road. Uh, and then obviously it kind of be like a, a minecart system where it would automatically, I guess, detect if it was side by side to, to do a two lane highway. Or if it was just one, it would just be, you know, kind of like white lined, uh, your one lane highway. Also with rubber, I was thinking, I'm like, you know, what are some other weapons we could do? I think a slingshot would be awesome. Either a couple different ways. I think you know you get get like some uh, some sticks and string that would give us uh, the slingshot, and we could shoot rubber pellets. Maybe we could break down into like little rubber pellets somehow. Or instead of string, we could you know obviously it'd be rubber and, and sticks, and um, we'd have the slingshot, and we could actually turn the gravel and break it down, take it down another level, and it would be uh you know like like dirt. It'd be like little rocks. And you could use that as ammunition. Wouldn't that be cool, guys? I mean, I know I know the uh, bow and arrow is really cool. I think a slingshot would be awesome. Outside of like them coming up with an idea to get us a gun, uh, maybe a pellet gun or something like that. That would be cool. I mean, obviously, I don't I don't think we should be getting like M16 and turning this into a, a first person shooter. But I was thinking a slingshot would be pretty cool. What do you guys think? Leave, leave a comment down below if you if you like this idea. I think it's great. Also, even shoes, like maybe maybe you could um, upgrade your, I guess, boots that you made and put rubber that way had soles and they'd last longer. I don't know. I mean, there's so many, I think there's so many other things you could do with rubber. I think rubber is definitely a viable resource that they could add into this game. Um, also, I think some other stuff I think they should bring back. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping they haven't already, like, finished the DLC. Maybe, maybe this is something someone will see and want to add. I think the enchantment table is a must. They have to bring the enchantment table. I had so much fun on the PC, um, just running around killing zombies, trying to get my XP levels up higher. And then, you know, it's it's so cool that it's random. You know, you're just like rolling the dice and hoping that you get something. I I, I think that's amazing. Enchantment table, XP meter, 
Uh, hunger bar. I know a lot of people hate the hunger bar. I think it just makes the game more dynamic. Uh, adds another layer to it as far as skill, strategy, and so forth. I think that's a. I think that's a must, guys. Also, uh, slimes, uh, pistons. I think sticky pistons would be amazing. Um, just that, just the complexity of like building different stuff and. Like right now on the Xbox 360, there's not really much you can do like outside of the the basics as far as like building elaborate traps or elaborate um, mechanisms. So I mean, I think I think a, a piston and a sticky piston would be awesome. That way we could do some auto like farming and so forth, um, melon seeds and pumpkin seeds and so forth. I think right now we have is I don't even know if there's melon seeds on the Xbox. I haven't come across uh, any melons. I don't I, I don't think there's any melons yet. What else is there? Um, Man, I don't know. I, I just I think the rubber. It's such a great idea. A slingshot. We could do slingshots. We could do rubber pellets. We could do rubber shoes. Maybe maybe rubber. Even another idea I had. I thought this. No, this is kind of stretching it. It with the rubber. If we made a um, let's say one block. It was just one block. It was all rubber, and you were allowed to <laughs> let's say put it in the ground, kind of like on the surface. I think if if an enemy or a mobster like walks over it, they kind of bounce up. That kind of like kind of shoots them off. Maybe not, you know, like twelve blocks away or anything like that. I'm thinking like, oh, it just shoots them up in the air, kind of. So you can use it almost as a defense mechanism of your house. So like, put it on the front door. I'm not sure, you know, if we want it to work with uh with us. Yeah. So all right, guys, if you could please be kind enough, leave me a comment. Uh, hit that like button if you like it. Please subscribe to my channel, and if you can, share this with everyone out there. All right, guys, that's going to wrap my video up. B-Pitch out. Stay classy, Denver.